so yeah guys um so yeah my first day in beijing let's give a little rundown uh the chinese people they are they're very very uh very um polite um but i've noticed they don't speak unless spoken to you know they're they're very much a culture where you know especially with a random black guy walking around it's like whoa like you know they really want to speak to me i've had about four or five people ask for photos which is really funny it's quite cool they're very friendly very lovely people but i just suppose they don't see many people that look like me especially the way i look with my hair and the way i dress as well walking around beijing um you know apart from that they're lovely uh the guy that works here the receptionist he was great he's amazing his name was bruce but that's not his, his real name his real name his real name was uh, Li Xiao, i think Li Xiao. um and he taught me a bit of uh, Chinese, so I'm learning words, you know, the simple, the basic words like ni hao, ni hao ma, um, na xie xie, xie xie ni. Um, what else am I trying to, uh, there's, there's literally, I've got a list in my phone of words that I'm learning, just trying to get through the day, like an average day learning, you know, how to speak to, uh, to the people. So tomorrow I've booked the Great Wall of China. I don't actually know which section of the Great Wall I'm going to, but I've made a friend that you guys saw in the video earlier. Um, I made a friend, he's from Italy. Uh, he's you know he's a great guy. His name's Arnie. Uh, he speaks German, Italian, and English. So he's really you know he's a real traveler. He's real real clued up on the world. Um, we just had you know a nice little chat, a sit down about you know social media, um, about things you know like YouTube, uh, you know travelers, people from London, you know girls. We were talking about everything, man. And we even uh, we we discovered we were speaking to one of the Chinese guys. We discovered that they can't use Facebook here. They can't use Instagram. They can't use Facebook. They can't use any social media. Uh, unless you're, uh, you know, from from London or wherever, and you're logged in through the VPN, you can't actually use any social media in this country. Um, it's like banned. They really don't want, you know, the Chinese people mixing with, uh, with with you know, British social media. Not one of them, British, just European and American social media. They don't want it. They've got their own outlets. They've got their own special, you know, Chinese servers uh, for their own apps, but they won't allow them to mix with us. So. If I wanted to add someone from Facebook here, like a friend on Instagram or something, they'd just be like, nope, that's not going to happen. So, you know, I, you know, I can't feel sorry for them or anything because the guy said that, you know, they get used to it. What can they do? That's just what, they, that's what they're into. I said, fair enough. Uh, but apart from that, you know, I've got my camera charged. I'm taking two cameras tomorrow. I'm going to get some cool photos taken of this uh, Great Wall, this section that we're going to. I think uh, tomorrow is going to be Monday. So the Forbidden City is closed. I really want to go there as well. Uh, maybe on Wednesday or maybe I don't know Tuesday or something. I'll go to the uh, the Beijing Zoo, go see some pandas, go see some pandas. <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna go see some uh, some pandas and some other creatures that obviously I've never seen in the parts of Europe. They'll only be here in China. Um, Thursday, you know, we'll, we'll go looking around the area. We'll get a, you know, we'll get a, a nice grip on um, on the area, of, you know, the shops and stuff. I might get some trinkets like for home. Like I really want to get this. There's this little panda, like little man that you can put money in top. Um, uh, I want to get there's some Dragon Ball Z stuff. I know I'm a super nerd. Um, there's some stuff like I want to get like little um, like trinkets that you put on like like plants and like front doors and like it, like like stuff to keep you safe and like luck stuff but you never get that stuff in Europe you can't get that stuff on Amazon man you can't get that shit off Amazon man um, but apart from that you know just a quick shop and uh, yeah apart from that I don't think there's anything else to get in Thailand when I get back to Bangkok I'll buy all the like you know the goods you know what I'm saying like the Rolexes you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? Um, all that kind of stuff we'll get that when we get back to Bangkok but for now I think we'll just get the basics in Beijing and uh, hopefully me and Arnie have a good day tomorrow. I've added him on Instagram. You guys add him too. It's Arnie Com. You see it down here. Arnie Com. Yeah, great guy. Uh, brilliant photographer. And um, yeah, he's leaving uh, at 3 a.m. in the morning uh, on Tuesday. So I'll be by myself till Friday. It's all good. And I'll speak to you guys soon.